Hello Libra! Welcome to your channeled messages with me, Eva Spirit, for the 10th to the 24th of June 2022. Let's get started. I'm going to take an oracle card from the Animal Angel deck. Messages for the Libra collective, please. Libra. 10th to the 24th, 2022. Libra. Let's tune into the guides. Yes. Libra, please. What do you want to talk to the Libras about today? What do you want to talk to the Libras about today? Uh, something feels uh, frayed. I'm hearing the word frayed. Also strained, um, a, re a strained relationship, a strained situation. Uh, there's a feeling here of something changing and it not being the same. It's like something has changed now, something is not quite the same anymore. Uh, there's been some sort of eye-opening uh, experience. Thank you. And um, yeah, things are forever altered is what I'm getting. All right. Ooh, and look at that. You've got the raven, which says prepare for change. See? Something has changed. It's not the same anymore. And there's a little bit of fear, understandably, actually, uh, a little bit of self-doubt, doubt in general. What's going on here? I'm not sure if I can trust this. It's also kind of, uh, for some of you, it's unexpected. And for some of you, it is expected. Or, or at least, let's say it makes sense. Prepare for change. Someone may have fallen in love with someone else or fallen in love with someone that they didn't expect. I am getting something here about someone perhaps realizing that they have feelings for someone and someone, this person could actually be in a relationship already. So this could be you, this could be someone around you. Um, feelings have changed. I feel like somebody was, was in this connection. It doesn't have to be romantic, of course, but I am getting that in this energy here. Um, in the beginning, someone was, for some reason, I want to say in it to win it. They, they were in this connection. They wanted to see it grow. They wanted to nourish it, but, um, but something happened or there was a, there was a moment of realization. This could be you. This could be the other person. And the next card we've got is the ant, which says cooperate for the highest good of the community so the message that i have been getting recently when i pull this card or when it comes out let's say is about uh when change happens to make sure that to do your best to make sure that others that may or may not be involved in the situation directly or indirectly are sort of um not used as collateral damage, not uh, not hurt, not involved unless they have to be, right? It's kind of like um, not letting people get caught up in something that's going on privately between two people or making sure that everyone's okay as much as possible because this change is something that really, yeah, they just said affects the foundations of some sort. Someone's feelings have changed here. I'm sorry if this is someone that you've been involved with and, and you know, they've been acting differently because if someone's been acting differently, you can be sure uh, feelings have changed. This is still relatively new is what I'm getting here. There's just some sort of shift that's happened in the relationship and it's like, huh. it's like, huh, I really, I really didn't expect that. Oh, um, but I am getting sort of a good feeling with it. That's why I get the sense that it could be that someone likes someone else. <laughs> you know, someone has feelings for someone else or someone's thinking about someone else. They didn't think they didn't, they didn't realize they still cared about perhaps. And it's sort of like, this is the beginning of something and it's, it's yet to be, the path is yet to be forged in terms of what this can become or will become but it definitely prepares a new road, okay? Let's get some cards from the tarot deck and see, ooh. Let's see what happens here. Okay, let's tune in again. <sighs> Libra, please. Libra. 
Thank you. The world, yeah. We've got the King of Pentacles that has come out here as well as the world. Somebody feels a sense of responsibility. So this could be quite a serious relationship as well. I'm getting sort of hierophant vibes too. So I feel like this isn't just some sort of casual thing. Um, somebody feels responsible for a connection of some sort. Um, they've, they've invested a lot into it. But the world indicates yet yeah, that change, the end of a chapter, four of cups. So an opportunity being presented, but focusing on the disappointments. So um, immediately what comes through is something about if this ends up being a breakup, I just have to say it, a breakup or taking a break, see this as an opportunity of self-discovery. That's what I'm getting there. And look at what's at the bottom of the deck. It doesn't have to be that you were together for a long time, but for some reason, someone someone feels responsible. Maybe, maybe you know, you relied on each other for something, or you you did you invested in something together, right? The hanged man, yeah. Don't take action just yet. So, as I said, I do feel this is relatively fresh energy. It's not necessarily going to be that you know things are going to start happening right away. It's more like um, this sense of, huh, something has shifted now in this connection. And now we, we prepare for change and see what happens here with the Raven card. Um, but it could definitely signal with the world here um, an ending of a chapter, okay? Something closing off. All right, Libra, that's what I got for you. I hope it helps. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe if you resonate with my work. Thank you so much. Take care, and I'll speak to you soon. Bye-bye.